Hey, this is the Swedish Guitar Nerd, and uh, today I'm comparing two guitars. How does this one, the Epiphone uh, Special 2, Les Paul, stack up to a 1989 Gibson USA Les Paul Custom? Something I'd want to know. So. Yeah, how do they differ? Well, of course, one is made in Indonesia and one was made some decades ago in the US. Um, construction wise, they are quite different from each other. Um, they share some of the woods. They have a lot of mahogany in them, the necks, the bodies. The custom has a maple top and uh, the fingerboards differ. Uh, the custom has uh, an ebony fingerboard and the uh, special two has a rosewood fingerboard. And the uh, controls differ, of course. The, the special two has just one volume, one tone, and the custom has separate volumes and tones for the pickups. And the biggest thing, of course, is that the Special 2 has a bolt-on neck, whereas the Les Paul Custom has a set in a glued-in neck. Um, and they are very different in body size. Yes. This is much thinner than that one. And uh, in... <laughs> In weight too, if you don't notice. This one's really light. And the Les Paul Custom isn't. Uh, it's in some ways not a fair comparison, of course, and it's not meant to be. Uh, it's not even a fair comparison by today's standards because this is a vintage. It's a 1989 and it was from the time when Gibson made good guitars, unlike today. Uh, and their quality standards were somewhere else. And um, I'm not sure if it would be the same thing if you had a brand new Les Paul Custom, actually. It's that big of a difference. But what the heck? Uh, I'll compare them anyway. Um, yeah. And the most important thing is, of course, the sounds. So I'll play... Uh, both through the exact same uh, signal path, the same effects and everything. And uh, I'll start with the clean sound and just use the bridge pickup and the neck pickup. Otherwise, I'll go on for hours. So, first competitor is the Special 2. <laughs> Yeah, that was the special too. And um, since this is a much thinner body and it's a bolt-on, uh, I mentioned this in the review for the special too. It is easier to get up 
to the high frets. It's much harder on that one. But here's the Les Paul Custom. With a clean sound. Yeah, uh, the neck profiles are slightly different. Um, uh, the Les Paul Custom has a more of a C shape, it's more rounded, and the uh, Special 2 has more of a D shape, it's more flat. But other than that, the dimensions are the same. It's no, you don't have to adjust from one guitar to another. It feels like almost like you're playing the same guitar. Okay. Let's do some high gain sounds. Or maybe I should try the Les Paul Custom first. I finished with a, I don't know, sustain test. Because uh, uh, the myth is that uh, setting guitars is, are much more, they give a much longer sustain. And I've been uh, trying to tell you that's not true. So well, we'll see. I'll do the same test with the special two and remember that they aren't in equals in any way. Um, 
because this has like uh, the neck is painted all the way into the neck pocket and uh, even the neck pocket is probably painted inside it so uh, you lose as much as a, there would be if there would be glue between them so well it would be interesting here's the lead sound on the special two <laughs> That was it. Uh, yeah, the sustain was slightly shorter on this one, but as I said, uh, the construction of that one isn't perfect either. So yeah, that was an Indonesian made Les Paul Special 2 from Epiphone compared to a Gibson USA Les Paul Custom. Uh, yeah. I hope you found this useful and uh, yeah, I hope this is a help for you when you're trying out guitars and thinking, man, that is good and that is bad. I should say, I really like the looks of this one. I mean, you see so many people play it, so I suppose that's it. It looks really cool. But it's not that big of a difference. Gibson will run scared now. Uh, really, that one, the big one, <laughs> feels, uh, I don't know, it's different because it's heavier, but um, I don't know, it seems easier to get around the Les Paul Special 2 actually. Um, the neck is more, yeah, more playable. And it's more, I think it's more enjoyable to have a lighter guitar, but that's my preference. Yours is probably totally different. Okay, this is a comparison between the Epiphone Les Paul Special 2 and the Gibson Les Paul Custom. Hope you found this useful. Thank you. Bye.